Place the inverted plate close to the Bunsen burner to reduce chances of contamination. Turn on the Bunsen burner. Loosen the cap of the bottle containing the inoculum. Hold an inoculation loop in your right hand and put the flame of Bunsen burner to blue and take the inoculating loop and heat at the peak of the blue flame until the wire is white hot and then allow to cool while keeping close to the Bunsen burner. Do not wave around the loop to cool quicker as it increases the chance of contamination. Without putting the loop down, lift the test tube containing the inoculum with your left hand and remove the cap of the bottle with a little finger on your right hand. Press pass the neck of the bottle through the flame two to three times so it becomes sterile. Once the bottle is sterile, put the loop into the suspension without touching the sides of the bottle. Remove the loop and reflame the neck of the bottle before closing the lid to sterilize. Partially lift the lid of the petri dish and with the loop containing the bacteria, rub a small circle immediately into the agar on the first dot at 12 o'clock to prevent your liquid from running. Reflame the loop and let it cool for 5 seconds by touching an unused part of the agar surface close to the edge of the plate. Use the loop to streak the bacteria across a quarter of the agar from the circle you just did in three to four lines. Reflame the loop and allow to cool. Then from the area you just streaked, streak another three to four lines from three to six o'clock. Reflame the loop and then do another three to four lines across the petri dish from where you just left. Reflame the loop. In the last quarter of the agar dish, you need to streak the bacterium in a zigzag formation from the outside of the agar towards the centre. Be careful not to streak the bacterium where you previously streaked as it will not get the desired separation and the zigzag of the bacterium should not touch the sides of the petri dish. Reflame the loop to sterilise before putting away. Turn Bunsen burner flame back to safety and please leave your agar plates on the side to be collected for incubation.